Hi, welcome to Talking Tech. I'm your host, Marcus Yam, and we are at CES 2023 in Las Vegas. I'm in the Intel Experience Zone, and we're gonna check out some of the latest and greatest technology that uses our silicon. Sometimes, for some reason, I spend a lot of time looking at task managers. So I'm very used to seeing a CPU. I'm definitely used to seeing a GPU, but I've never seen an NPU. So to tell me more about that, is Garth from Intel? Uh, yeah, th show me everything there is to know about an NPU and what we're looking at here. Yeah, so this is the NPU. This is the third generation Movidius processor. And um, NPU stands for? Neural Processing Unit. Okay. So we refer to it internally as VPU, so you'll hear VPU and NPU kind of interchanged uh, commonly. Um, but as it shows up in the task manager, it shows up as a neural processing unit. And, what and, the, yeah. sorry, this, and this, is, this is not test software, right? This is, no, this is this a regular is, Windows. Yeah, this is regular Windows. It's a you know, Windows 11. Um, this is Windows Studio effects that we're showing. These are all built into the operating system, these effects. So it's built directly into the camera driver. It's taking advantage of the neural processing unit, offloading things like background segmentation, uh, automatic framing, uh, eye contact correction, those kinds of things. And I'm watching task manager right now. Yeah. It's, it's obviously working on these visual effects but the CPU and GPU are just kind of chilling there. The one that's doing all the heavy lifting is the NPU. That's right, exactly. So the, the real advantage of this is that, you know, if you're in a video conference call and you're doing, say, opening PowerPoint or something like that, it really improves the performance, um, improves the responsiveness of the system because all that AI, instead of being on the CPU or the GPU, is now offloaded to our uh, Movidius processor. And it's taking care of all that AI work and you can leave the you know, other heavy lifting to uh, the CPU or the GPU. It's, just, it's acceleration, offloading exactly, that acceleration. Exactly. So we know like, what a CPU looks like, what a GPU looks like. Uh, right now, Movidius, the VPU, is, is a discrete solution, so that's a separate chip offering. Right, and if you, were to, if you were to open up this laptop and you were to look inside, you would see a little M.2 card, um, and it looks very much like an NVMe drive or something like that. Um, there's a, a small chip on board there that is doing all of the uh, AI acceleration. Yeah. This is just the beginning, so a lot exactly. of software is about to come, but you have a little bit here in Windows Studio's effects. Can you just show me a couple a couple of neat things that are kind of yeah. the, the, what the NPU enables. Yeah, so let me let me show you about it. So as you can see from the screen, uh, we have the all the effects listed. I currently have them all turned on, and you can see that our NPU is only you know consuming uh, what about 38, 40 percent, right? Um, and our CPU utilization is down below 10 percent. And the nice thing about the camera app, which I'm, I'm showing here, is that it really gives a good demonstration of all these effects. So if I were to say, you know, move around, um, you can see that the camera actually focuses on me even though I'm moving around in the, in the space, right? So if I'm on a conference call, I can meander around my office. Um, I don't have to be you know, sitting in front of the chair, you know, confined to that space. I can get up, move around, and not worry about you know, getting out of uh, the frame, because it's automatically keeping me in frame. And the nice thing is that I don't have to have an expensive camera. This is a camera that's built into the, the bezel of this laptop. It's not panning or tilting or zooming. It, it's all being done by the AI effects. Very cool. Um, the other thing that's really great is the background blur. You see it's really high quality segmentation, especially around my hair, maybe around my, my shoulders. You know, one of the great things about these Windows Studio effects is they've done a lot of work to make sure that um, people who have, you know, different hairstyles, you know, that, that's a big part of their personality and want to make sure that that personality comes through on a conference call. So, you know, really being able to distinguish you from your background uh, using these neural networks is, is, really, is really great. One other thing I want you to show me is, I know we're talking right here, yeah. and eye contact is such a big thing, exactly. but if we were talking uh, through like Teams, we'd, sometimes you see the people's eye line are, are you know, looking right below that. Right. Um, show me that, the, what is this called, the, uh, the eye contact. And yeah, that's, so there's something called eye contact correction, exactly. And what it's going to do is it's going to make it look like I'm looking more into the camera, even though I'm looking at the screen. So let me, let me it's really, it's really subtle. It's subtle, but when you see it. But yeah. when you see it, it, it looks really good. And then, you know, when I turn it off and on, that's really the best way to to see the effect take place. So I'm going to just switch it on and off, and you'll be able to see my eyes as they drop and then look back okay. into the camera. All right, I'll have a look at the All screen. All right, so first, you know, it looks like I'm looking into the camera. Um, I'm looking about here on the screen. And now when I switch off eye contact correction, you actually see my eyes just sort of drop. So that's oh, yeah. pretty, pretty, pretty noticeable. There we go. As I switch it on and off. That's eye contact right there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Exactly. Well, pretty cool. Glad to see this just the beginning from uh, our Movidius VPU, which is the NPU seen in Task Manager, the Neural Processing Unit. That's right. Great. All right, Garth, thank you so much. Hey, thank you very much.